Thank you for joining us for News 19 at 9 tonight. I'm Emily Forrester. And I'm Greg Screws. And while some of us have city or county water available in the homes with the turn of a faucet, one neighborhood in Petersburg, Tennessee is living without it. People living on Patton Hollow Road in Lincoln County say for years they've pleaded with local utilities and city leaders to get water to their homes, which are located on a hilltop. News 19's Gerald Burke joins us now live in the studio with more on what those residents deal with without what they say is a basic life necessity. Daryl. That's right, Greg. Those living on Patton Hollow Road tell me they're dependent on unreliable sources of water, something that has left them puzzled. They say the request to have city or county water is a simple ask for a vital need. Walk a mile in our shoes. Imagine if it was your grandmother or grandfather having to deal with this and not have water. In the town of Petersburg, people with homes on Patton Hollow Road are dependent on springs and rainwater for their water supply, both of which they say is unreliable. Because it doesn't rain every day and springs dry up sometimes, residents say they must desperately conserve their usage. We do have to be very careful about water use. Uh, we have on occasion gone weeks, if not uh, sometimes over a month without water. Jeb Buck and his family rely on this cave for their water, but he says frequent power outages in the neighborhood have left them without. When the electric goes out, your water goes out because it's tied to whatever electric system, electric pumps that we have. The problem has made life difficult for Dale Campbell and his wife. You have to cut your water on for a minute to wet down and then soap up and then cut it on for another minute and have to rinse off and take a shower every other day. It's kind of embarrassing to go to your neighbor's house and get five gallon buckets of water just to flush your toilet. The utilities say in order to provide water, a water line would have to be built into the mountain, something that would require an extensive infrastructure project. Residents had this message for their local leaders about their issues. Everyone up here is relying on an uh, unreliable source of water, and that's all we need from the city or county is a reliable source of water. Work together, work with us to get grants, and work with the different resources that we have locally to bring the water up here. Now, residents signed this petition that shows Lincoln County Mayor Bill Newman supporting the building of that water line. I reached out to Mayor Newman about the situation, but he declined to comment. Greg?